Hi, Sean Mann again, and I'm delighted to welcome you to video two. This time, this video is from the women's point of view, and uh, we're going to call this one, Why Does Valentine's Day Make Us Crazy? For all of you ladies out there. Now, who could be better to answer that question than relationship coach, relationship expert, and author, Susan Winter. So I'm going to throw that open to you right now, Susan, because I know you've got so many things to say on this. Why does Valentine's Day make women crazy? Thank you, Sean. That is a great topic and it's really needed for all the ladies out there. We experience social pressure on Valentine's Day. Not only the marketing, the advertisers, the florists, the restaurants, the jewelers, but our friends. So where is he taking you? What's happening? Is he planning something special? Do you think he'll give you a ring? Now these are well-meaning people. The advertisers I'm not so sure about, but they're doing their job. They've got a product to sell. So what happens is ladies are impacted continually with this dramatic one day filled with expectations. Somehow all of this has synthesized itself to whatever my man does equals the amount of love that he has for me. So the, the only way to get us out of the Valentine's Day crazies is to absolutely obliterate that construct. Not valid, not true. Yes, we've all seen movies where the man is running through the airport trying to catch the woman before she gets on her flight and stops everybody on the airplane and I love you and I didn't mean to screw up. And, but in the real world, functional relationships that flourish live and thrive on small, consistent acknowledgement, appreciation of our partner. If we're looking for the grand gesture on Valentine's Day, chances are we may be disappointed. Our guy could come up with what he thinks is a great idea, like synthetic motor oil that I got for my Valentine's Day. Not too many years ago from my very young boyfriend who knew I had a Corvette and thought, I'll give her synthetic motor oil. Not such a sexy gift. So ladies, you might get a present that's not exactly what you expected and you may not have the grand gesture that you wanted. But the question to really ask yourself is, does this man love you? And if you know the answer to that, let him off the hook. Let him off the hook, let yourself off the hook. One day does not define the entire quality of your relationship. It is the 364 other days out of the year, so give yourself a break and give the great gift to your partner of giving him a break. Lighten up on Valentine's Day. Most of it is sociological programming from marketers. And just have a good time being with your partner. Be, be grateful that you've got somebody in your life who cares about you. That's absolutely fantastic. And I, and, and I love the way you finished that. Lighten up on yourself on Valentine's Day. Lighten up on your partner. It is just one day. There's a lot of marketing pressure. And of course, we all would like that very, very special Valentine's Day. Look forward to seeing you on the next video with Susan Winter and Sean Mann.